Now the Ravens have no choice but to make some moves. They're actually forced to make some moves today. Uh, reason being because according to Brian McFarlane, uh, a.k.a. Ravens salary cap, he breaks down all the Ravens salary cap news on Twitter, and he does a phenomenal job of it. He said the Ravens are presently a little over two million over the cap, not under, over the cap. So Ravens, hey, we ain't mad at it because Eric DaCosta's been taking that credit card. He said, hey, Steve Bishotti, let, let me hold a credit card this, this offseason. You ain't been letting me get it that much the past couple of offseasons, but let me get it this year. Bishotti said, here, there you go. Eric DaCosta been doing nothing but swiping, 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 swiping. But now he did a little too much swiping. Hey, we not mad, though. And the Ravens are over. And Brian McFarland said they're a little over two mil uh, over the cap. They will need to be under the cap by midnight tonight. So saying, hey. All that spending you did, it's time to pay it back. It's time, it's time to pay down that credit card bill. You know when your balance gets a little high, you're like, ooh, I don't want to pay it. I might do minimum payments. And that, hey, we'll see if the Ravens do minimum payments or they pay that whole balance down or they do a big chunk. We'll see by today. So this is going to be a quick update because we're going to have to do another update on this later on. But anyway, he said they likely have already done so, but they will need to restructure a contract or two to get under the cap and create some cap cushion for injuries and practice squad elevation. So... I would assume, based off of how the Ravens operate, that when they do make those moves, that they will clear about seven mil in cap space. What moves will they make? No clue. Usually they go to Ronnie Stanley to restructure. Usually they go to Marlon Humphrey to restructure. They could end up going to Lamar Jackson to restructure. We'll see very soon. Maybe Justin Tucker. I, we'll see really soon. But I would estimate that they would clear about seven mil in cap space. So they will have about five mil in cap space once they finish doing all their restructures. Uh, so that five mil could get them a little bit to work with or whatnot just to stay ready. So they ain't got to get ready or they, hey, they could get even more just in case because Eric DaCosta did say a couple days ago, hey, we want to be in a position to where we got some money and we got some cap space to where we can make a trade before uh, that trade deadline. So maybe it might end up being a little more than five mil, but I know it will be at least, at least a minimum of five mil that the Baltimore Ravens end up having after they make restructures. Now, keep this in mind, too. Just because they make restructures and they get under a certain amount of the salary cap, it doesn't mean like, all right, well, they won't restructure anything else anymore. No, they can make all the restructures they want to get even, um, even more under the salary cap. But this is just be, since they have to get under by tonight, they're going to do whatever they got to do to get under by tonight, today, uh, so they can meet that requirement. But there's always more that could be done if they need to open up more room. But for what restructures they do, we will keep you updated on that, and we'll find that out later today. Uh, and I will see you then. Team, keep it clean. I love y'all. I appreciate y'all. Make sure you check out uh, the question from subscriber video we dropped earlier this morning about a move that I know, I know Ravens fans would just love it if it went down. To watch that video, click right here.